What's going on guys? JJ Wilson is here. I won't make this audio too long. I just want to touch on the manga series Golden Kamui. Uh, yeah, it's been a long while since I last did a recording. Um, I'm trying not to make this too long. The last video slash recording that I did for Golden Kamui lasted like 20 minutes. <laughs> 20 minutes. So, uh, And I was really into it because, you know, I, I was shocked at what I was seeing regarding the the seven divisions leader lieutenant sarumi as well as the events that happened in russia when uh kiraranke ended up dying and uh ogata pretty much baited uh asirpa to kill him so that way uh, she would know, know what it's like to kill a person she would know and so thankfully that didn't happen sugimoto was there to uh kind of prevent that from happening and uh it's amazing because since the beginning of this this series like all these people have been running up and around all over Hokkaido <laughs> looking for the gold stashed by Asirba's father uh Wilk you know that's his uh that's his Polish name Wilk but um man this so they, uh, uh, I think it was chapter 280 if I'm not mistaken chapter 280 and finally they've narrowed down the location of the gold they finally narrowed it down from uh, Asirpa's father, Wilk, or also known as Noparabo. I finally remember that name, too. Man, uh, so apparently now everybody is going to Hakodate and doing a little research on that place. It's the oldest city on the island of Hokkaido. It's the oldest city, and there's a fortress there that, that was built around the 1860s called uh gori gori kyaku i believe that is called i have to double check the name it's japanese so let me double check that name okay gori okaku excuse me that <laughs> i knew i was gonna get it wrong it's also known as the five point fort so apparently the gold is supposed to be there somewhere that's where noparabo might have stashed it before the tragic events happened where most of the ainu perished yeah, that's where the goal is supposed to be. So, yeah, it's Fort Goryokaku. <laughs> so, yeah, so everybody's going over there to to that place. And um, I can't wait to see what they're going to do from there. I know the story's not going to act exactly end with them getting the goal because there's probably going to be a big fight amongst the groups. Hijikai's group, Sugimo's group, Surumi's group. Like, they're... It's going to be a big tug of war to see what happens with the gold and everything. So I just wanted to let everybody know that. I mean, subscribers of mine anyway. Since I'm still following this manga pretty heavily. Because I'm kind of on the edge of my seat seeing what's going to happen next. But anyway, uh, that's going to be it. Let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you all next time.